I'm Dr. Jay Wartman, and I'm speaking. I'm a speaker on the Low Carb Cruise. So how's the cruise been, you think? Uh, it's been good, yes. Some interesting talks, some fun time together with everyone. So what, what was your favorite talk? You know, I, I like the endocrine talks. Uh, Jackie gave a very good talk, and so did uh, Michael Fox. So I found those very interesting. So what's your... Uh, um What's most fun, uh, except for, for the presentations on the cruise? Uh, well, I enjoy hanging around with my little daughter. She, she enjoys this kind of thing so much that I get pleasure watching her. So th did she enjoy uh, the cruise trip? She loved it. She loves it. She's like the queen of the cruise ship, you know? What uh, do you think about this year's cruise? I thought this year's cruise was amazing. I, we in, tried to invite enough different people to talk about various topics that people were interested in. Um, and in the past, we've had a lot of people that people would know. But this time, I thought, you know what? It'd be kind of cool to get some people you may not know who have things to say. And we have so many in the community that are coming up that we really need to highlight those people. And it was really a, an honor to be able to give them that platform. I am a physician. And I have a very uh, knowledgeable, intelligent, insightful uh, wife who helps me greatly. And uh, she is actually the driving force behind this. She actually turned my interest to this because I had, I had gone to medical school and learned none of this. And when I had heard things about the Atkins diet and, and frankly, almost any other diet, I dismissed it because it wasn't something I was taught, and I just assumed that I would know. I knew everything, I knew the best way. And much to my chagrin, it turns out that I was wrong. And most physicians don't know this, and it's because we're not taught the right thing. Yeah, I'm dietitian Cassie. I'm a registered licensed dietitian, and I own a um, health and nutrition coaching company called Healthy Simple Life. And it's my second time on a low carb cruise, and I was talking about 10 non dietary reasons why people aren't losing weight and getting healthy, which is surprising as a registered dietitian to not talk about food at all. Could you give us the, the top three reasons right away? Yeah, the number one reason would be inflammation. Inflammation is at the root of all chronic disease and weight gain. And most of us have it for one reason or another, thanks to stress, antibiotic use, over-exercise, lack of sleep. Um, the number two reason would be hormones. A lot of people don't focus on getting their hormones under control. If your hormones are imbalanced, then none of the pieces of your puzzle are going to come together. And I would say the third reason is stress, because everyone's living these busy, stressful lifestyles. And if we're not focusing on stress management, it really wreaks havoc on all areas of our body. What has been the best thing so far, do you think? I really enjoyed Tom Naughton's um, presentation about obesity in kids and how to get the message that obesity is not a character flaw or something that's wrong with a person, but it's about your body chemistry and that we've been continuously told the wrong things our whole lives and it's hard to change and overcome that. And it's not a fault within the person, but the environment that we live in. Definitely. So except for all the lectures, what did you enjoy on the, on the cruise? I enjoyed the excursions. I mean, getting to see beautiful islands I've never been to, St. Martin, um, white, uh, the pink sand beaches on St. Kitts, and a little bit of shopping. Gotta love the shopping. <laughs> Who are you? Isabel. And where are you? Um, at a party. A party. So what are you doing here? Um, I'm, I'm in an interview. What food is good for you then? The food that doesn't have any sugar, food coloring, or gluten. That's very true. So what's your, fa what's your favorite really healthy food? Mm, I think it's the hamburger, the inside. So what's your favorite food? My mom's chili. She makes really good chili. Steak. Snow crab. Snow crab and snake. I like both of them. Yeah. Snake, what? Snow <laughs> crab and steak. I've never Snow tried crab and snake. snake. Maybe snake is pretty good. Maybe. Maybe it tastes like chicken. I wouldn't know. I don't know what you want, man.
if people are watching and they're considering to come next year, why should they uh, book? Well, number one, it's my crew, so you, you better you better come. <laughs>